Welcome to Take 5, your five-minute inspirational message from Solid Rock Drogheda. Now, I know some of you listen to these Take 5 messages on radio, so you can't see what I'm wearing today. But for those who are watching on video, I'm wearing a suit and a tie. That doesn't happen very often. I'm not the kind of person who wears a suit and tie a lot. In fact, in, in church on a Sunday, if I turn up wearing a suit and a tie, the, there'll always be people, even if they see me in the car park, they say, oh, we're having a baby dedication today, are we? Because you're dressed for the photographs. Well, today I'm dressed like this because I was straight after filming this, I'm on my way to a funeral. I'll be speaking at a funeral service, a funeral service for a, a lovely Christian lady uh, in one of our churches who unexpectedly was taken ill and died. And a uh, great, great tragedy has affected family, left family behind. Obviously, a lot of hurt and a lot of grieving. Now, as I was reflecting about this, this, uh, this Christian sister, uh, she's a nurse and she had to train for many years to, to be a nurse. And that training, when it, when it was completed, it was a bittersweet moment because it meant that she could now fulfill the profession she was called to do. But it also meant that she would leave her home nation to go overseas. And so, so she would have to say goodbye to people that she loved. And so there was the pain of saying goodbye to people and knowing she would not see them for a while. But there was the excitement of going and fulfilling the calling for which she had been preparing and studying, which eventually landed, landed her here in Ireland, where she became an important part of one of our churches. You know, as I'm reflecting about this, I'm thinking the Bible says that the years we live on this earth are but a fleeting moment compared to eternity. And so we can truly think about the time we spend here on earth as being our training, uh, preparing us for the real important life that lies ahead. And that is how we spend all of eternity. Yes, whenever we graduate from this training and this particular sister graduated from this earthly training earlier than anyone had expected or wanted, there is painful goodbyes. I, I know how that loss feels. In my life, I've lost both my parents. I've lost a child. I know the pain of saying goodbye to people that you love. But in eternity, there is a greater, a richer, a grander life waiting for us. And that is what we were always intended to be. This brief moment, comparatively speaking, this fleeting life that we spend on earth is preparing us for something far, far greater. The sister that I will be going to speak at her funeral in, in a few minutes time, she is now enjoying that life that is more real and more vibrant and more authentic than anything she ever experienced here on earth. And the, of course, because she received Jesus Christ as her savior, the training was successful and she graduated with full honors. The Salvation Army quite rightly refer to passing from one life into the next one as being a promotion to glory. I, I think that's an absolutely wonderful way of putting it. And so this sister that is now living her life more full, more real, more beautiful and more grand has now graduated from her earthly training. I don't know how long your earthly training will be. I don't know how, la how long my earthly training will be, but let's not fall into the trap of thinking what's happening here is all that this is about. This is simply the preparation for the real life that is about to begin. Let's make the most of our training and look forward to the future, not with fear, but with confidence. We may be temporarily separated from people that we love, but let's face the future with confidence in Jesus' name. Thank you for joining us for this Take 5 today. Join us again tomorrow for another Take 5, your five-minute inspirational message from Solid Rock Drogheda.